Hi everybody, this is Glenda with Fraylands and Friends again. Tonight, we are going to paint Mr. Whale. I think he's looking okay. I have mounted him for the second time. Okay, here's what happened. <laughs> Let's just say I had him mounted to a board with some wire. When I baked him the first time, the board curled. <laughs> it curled. I was trying to figure out how to mount him on something else, and I decided, well, I'm going to have to pretty much get rid of the wires. But that was after his tail had already broken off and his flipper had already broken off. So I had to do quite a bit of repair work on him, but I think he's looking okay, as long as he just stays together. But his tail is on the seafloor because it needs that support. He came out, of the, I made some starfish to kind of go around there, but I don't really see any of the patchwork too bad where I had to patch him up. It doesn't look like, you know, it's it looks fairly smooth. So for what it is, he's got a little wart there. That's okay. I did put the warts on his snout and on his chin. So I'm going to try and figure out how to paint him and be back. I'm going to start out doing his underside. No, he doesn't have legs. I'm going to paint those black. To hopefully get him to not show up so much. I had to use some toothpicks and in order to keep them from being so blunt I put some clay around them but I will separate that out with paint. I'm going to start with his underbelly and under his mouth here because I think it'll be easier to do it now. So if you can see, I'm just going in here with white. Now I'm not going to paint that stand part with anything. This part is going to be a lot of fun. Trying to get in, in behind here into his. And if you're thinking, well, it might have been easier if you'd have painted that first, it's like, well, then how would I have baked it? <laughs> Because I did think of that myself. It would be much easier, but it wouldn't have been, I would. I don't know. I just don't know what that would have done to the paint if it was already painted before I add, attached him to this and baked it. So I kind of wanted to just play it safe, I guess. Yeah, I made kind of a mess with this. That's why I wanted to go under here first. Because I didn't figure it was going to go easy. <laughs> and I can, I can kind of hide the mistakes. If I did it on, if I was trying to do this while the top was wet or something, it would be a major problem. It'd be darn hard to do. Now I might go over that with a little bit of light gray later to bring out those bumps. Because I did put those bumps and stuff that picture showed that they have I think I called them like little warts. <laughs> They're not actually warts. They're just there. Okay. 
keep meaning to bring some paper towels in. I want to make up, mix up some gray. Real dark because I want to add some blue. I hope everybody's been having a good time. We went to the doctor today for our checkup, and <laughs> we're at that point in life where now he wants to start seeing us every six months. So <laughs> our insurance allows one free physical a year. Now see that just gets so dark even just with those two little drops. Okay. <laughs> okay, let's clean this up. I never knew why painters did the things they did with their palettes. The way they mix paint one right off of another. Beginning to get the idea. Isn't as strong as I thought it was. Yeah, I am kind of hitting other things that I probably will change with a finer brush later. Maybe have a, might have Joe do him because he's got a steadier hand than I do. So I was saying we went to the doctor today <laughs> don't you just love it when they say things like well you know you're getting to that age <laughs> and it's like I already know this so you have to rub it in <laughs> they think they gotta rub it in just cause they're getting to that age too you know 
they got to rub it in on the rest of us. He's just a few years older than, than we are. He had a student there today, which was very interesting because I'm always up for, you know, a student coming in and learning because, you know, when I was practice, learning to, to be a nurse, I had to be, I was a student and I had to, you know, they had to ask people if they could bring me in. So it's like, yeah, sure. <laughs> I am all for it. kind of even on both sides where that, where that goes. I don't think I managed quite to do that, but I'm going to be doing another, another layer of the white. I'm going to have to because it just... Where he's got his eye there they're hard to see in in the pictures I mean because they're so small and I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to paint him a, just kind of a I'll add a little bit of black just a tiny bit of black and get those eyes kind of go over them This is not easy. Okay, I'm going to let this dry for a bit. And then I'll come back and do some more on it. <laughs> okay, I have brought Joe in here with me because... Let's face it, he's got a steady hand, and I don't. And I've got him like this, like I had him. But that underneath side that I was doing white, it needs to be done better. I mean, it needs to be at least have another coat. I, I can angle the camera down. If, or Well, you want to pick him up for that, don't you? And as far as these guys, I will go over them later with uh, probably another day with some black or well, something. You want white here? Yeah, on his underside. If you get it on here, don't worry too much. But but that that is that blue is still. That's one reason why I want you to. Joe's just got a much steadier hand than I do. I wish I had your, <laughs> not just your steadiness, but your, your, you take it so slow and attention to detail, and I just don't do very good at that. Okay, how far down? 
okay, just, yeah, there, and then I got in under here as much as I could, but if we don't get, if we don't get it complete there, it's not going to, well, it might show depending on where you go from, but just the underside of his belly there as much as you can. It's kind of hard with those stands there. Yeah. They kind of make a bit of a problem, but we can only do the best we can. But that's why I chose you for this job. <laughs> be painting a little too soon. Might be. Maybe we should just leave him to dry and finish another day. It would be better to do that than to have him. Because that's wet right there. Yeah, and I can tell it's some, some of us soaking in, it's going to need another coat. Maybe a better wait. Yeah. Well, the jury is in. <laughs> we didn't finish him yet, but I think he's going to look great. But I'm just afraid that the blue is going to get on that white and it's going to yeah. be. I know. I see what you're to, talking about. Gray instead of white. Yeah. Well, that's it for tonight. I love you all. Please remember to wear those masks and use the ha uh, hand sanitizer and wash your hands. But you can smile and wave anytime. And hey, make that your virtual handshake if you need to. <laughs> and that handshake goes a long way. It can go clear across the street. No, just have this smile and wave. And show people you care. And I love you. We'll see you tomorrow.